So question number three that came in that we didn't address yesterday is simply this. Should the government be in charge of the economy and internal and external affairs and leave the caring for people to the church? Now, that's an interesting question in the sense of what role should the government play in, uh, in socialist values and caring for the people? So if you remember, if you were there yesterday, one of the things I said was that at the heart of politics is how we govern and care for people and for the individual. So I don't think that having socialist values is something that shouldn't be in government. In fact, I think that God establishes leaders to, to govern people in order to make sure that people are cared for. And so I would never promote that uh, the government should deal with the economics and leave the caring for people to groups like the church. One, the church can't handle all of it. Two, it is the responsibility of government to make sure that people are cared for. And what you get in the wonderful world of politics is that some people have more of a, a socialist concern than others do, and people try to balance uh, economic and socialist concerns for the nation to make that work. All of that being said, I also think that the church has a large part to play in caring for people, but so does everyone. And yet I think when you look at what the church does in our society, in cultures around the world, uh, the church does take on a wonderful proportion of caring for people. And that's setting the example, that's living out the principles of Jesus that we talked about, that all people have value before God, that stewardship and compassion should be high values for all people, including government leaders.